okay welcome to my youtube channel uh this is cell forecasting in machine learning and this is our third video in this tutorial series i uh, just to remind you of what we covered in our previous tutorial uh, in our previous tutorial we learned how to check missing vowels then after we saw how we can fill or fix missing vowels so that was about our previous tutorial in this video we are going to learn about feature selection how can we separate uh, x features and y feature when we say x features we mean we mean input feature these are the input feature we feed into a logarithm and the y feature is the class we predict so let me show you here what is x and what is y so red first month second month and and no 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 let me say red sales sales in first month sales and uh, second month is x features these are the features we input into a model then to predict these features this feature so uh, from here from here up to here these are x features and this is y the class or something we predict so in this video this is our task and here we go let me put comment and say and write feature selection feature selection we want to select features so x is equal to data dot i lock i lock in python pandas is for indexing and select the selection it is used to select some yeah, select rows and the columns so here i want to select columns so i lock put a bracket then something like this then we need from column number one up to column number three yes enter y y is equal to data dot i lock square bracket then negative one I'm, I'm going to tell you what the meaning so when i say it is direct i lock this is like uh, yeah i lock and I, I don't know I, I don't remember this is like semicolon you know comma then he, three we mean that we want to select it from first column second column and third column uh, the meaning of this is to select row number negative one so if this let me, let me show you this is a, just a simple concept if this is low uh, this is zero one two three if this is zero means this is negative one so when we put negative one we means we mean we want to select uh, the last the last column so let me learn this cell yes and here let me display x dot head so you can see clear now you can see x contain red cells in the first month and the cell in 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 a, in a second month so let me insert cell below let me display y dot head and see what's 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 yes as you can see it this is is our last i mean our last quorum so this is is how we can do feature selection in python pandas so here we have divided our data into x which are the inputs and the y which is the class or something we want to predict thanks for watching uh, this is end of our tutorial 
number three in sales forecasting using machine learning uh, in next tutorial we are going to learn how we can convert words into number how we can convert words into number if you can clear see here there is some here there is some words you know four nine seven so we needed to change all of these into numbers so this is our next part of tutorial series in cell forecasting uh, using machine learning thanks for watching to put a short summary of what we have learned we have learned how to divide the x features and the y feature by using iLock which is Python pandas method for indexing and selection uh, thanks for watching this is an end of our tutorial do not forget to like put comment and subscribe for next video update see you in next tutorial